The productivity and sustainability of agriculture, forestry and fisheries depend on healthy and biodiversity-rich ecosystems. This is critical to maintain environmental flows, nutrient-rich soils, clean water, pollination and the control of pests and diseases. Ecosystem, ecosystem services and biodiversity seems to be a word that people don't understand. And it's about our life, the life on the planet. And people don't understand that we have to protect these environmental services in order to maintain clean water, good soil, rich biodiversity for the future. So it's important that policymakers understand the value of the production of ecosystem services and promote and help farmers to produce mo much more of it, not only for themselves, but also for the millions of people who depend from agricultural systems. You need to take a landscape as a whole because when you have forests, you have pastures usually, you have agriculture, and all of them use these environmental services but also help protect environmental services if the management is done in a, in, a, in a good way. So it is an integrated approach which is needed and not a sectoral approach. And this obviously needs a lot of collaboration. Many countries are understanding and adopting policies to protect and maintain pollinators. Pollinators give you 35 of the total food we produce. It is impossible to think to produce some crops without having pollination. And we have made calculation, and this is equal to more than $200 billion value in terms of food production. Without ecosystem services and ecosystem management, there will be no survival, because the water will not be available anymore in the quantity needed, pollinators will disappear, and the soil will erode. So without taking care of ecosystems and their services, there is no food production in future. Very simple.